What's going on, folks? Hey, what up, what up? What up yes, folks? Sir. I can see podcast episode 76, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, yes sir. sir. Yeah, doing our damn. thing. We chilling. Yep. Uh, then switched up the look for a little bit. You know oh, yeah. Saying? I'm loving this already. Just trying some stuff. You know what I'm saying? Feeling good. More loungy. I Feeling like the it. the vibes. I'm mean, yeah. the old podcast, you know? Oh, yeah, it's for sure. So chilling. it's it's a lot as usual. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. The, the go-to of things going on and things that's been going on. But, uh. I just want to start off by saying, how's everybody been doing now? Oh man, doing? look, I'm, I'm, oh. I'm, I'm looking for a sugar mama, sugar grandmother, gotcha. sugar auntie. Rent and gas is just sky high. Like, so anybody, you know. Like you said, sugar mama, sugar see, auntie. Exactly. Yeah. So, um, you know, we can sugar talk, everything. you know, on the phone, you know, I can just, you know, we can just vibe, you know, just, just that. You need, you need an ear, I'm here. So, just something. Bars. The boy said, you need an ear, I'm exactly. here. That's so you know I'm serious, so. Well, yeah. um, you need a heat, you need a yeah. mirror. Oh. Yep. I'm I'm good. I uh, oh. <laughs> I uh, just Strong. started back my stream on Facebook. Yeah, yeah. yeah. oh, I've seen it. It's yeah. a that's like games is back yeah. in the build, building. Um, and uh, I'm trying to get out of my job right now. Like, so I'm just trying to find something else to do. At that's the, the wave. Hey, during, man, that's... You know, during this transition yep. that I'm trying to make. So uh, yeah, that's hey, basically man, what I've been up to. I'm with that. How are you feeling that, man? Shit, usual nigga working. <laughs> That's all I do. Why, why so aggressive though? I just I'm working. working. Shit, you working. know, man. Why you ask me? No, I'm yeah. goddamn working. working. I'm not bro. supposed to check in and see right. how you feeling. Don't ask me again. <laughs> you know where I'm at. I'm, I'm working again. Right. Right. When we leave this pod, guess what I'm about to be doing? Working. working. <laughs> When I wake up tomorrow, if God says the same, I'm working, and that's hard. And I'm okay with that. You know what I'm saying? This is what we signed up for. You yeah, know, of course. people tend to <laughs> forget that when you work for yourself, you got to work ten times harder. And I don't think people true. know that. Lord, give it. Lord, people take it away. Don't understand? Yeah, yeah. people know yeah. that. You don't understand. It's it's not just oh you wake up and the money falls into your lap. No, you got to like have that self discipline to make sure. Hey, I got to do this. I got to do that. So. That's really what it's been for me. Just probably uh, put my schedule, try to get into that rhythm of I need to do this, I need to do this, because yeah. it it be easy to just let me take a nap real quick and then three oh, four boy, hours is naps. gone by and now you're like damn it, the naps is deadly. At a certain age, there ain't no such thing as naps. It's hey. just like sleep. <laughs> like, naps is deadly. Just, that yeah. hour turns into three four hours. You're like quick, God, damn. Bro. I definitely so, did that two days ago. Yeah. I, I got home, got it, got Sorry home at like two. Passed out for like four hours. Woke up at six fifteen, and my son was like, "Yep, I'm I'm awake now. Finally, too. He uh-huh. he literally slept with me the same oh, time man. and everything. Yeah. He was like, okay, cool.' Yeah, I woke up. I was like, "Damn, it's six up." <laughs> One thing I realized about um, getting older now, I used to whenever I used to take a nap, I used to be like, "Damn, I'm gonna be up all night." Nowadays, yeah. if I take a nap, I can still go to sleep. Yep, at night. That's the like, power of uh, the not me. getting. getting. <laughs> like, I can still, I can still go to sleep now. If I take right. like an hour, and I can still go to sleep. Like when I was younger, if I took an hour, and I wasn't going to sleep at all. Yeah, that's so, what I'm oh, saying. fully like, rested. Like, like, <clears throat> I slept anything when I was young. I was like, man, I'm good. Mm-hmm. I can go, go do an eight hour shift. Yep, man, mm-hmm. Max. not really, but yeah. Yeah, how you been, man? How you been? Uh, how oh, you exactly. Been? Wow, you asked? That's oh, that guy. Wow, my bad. Yes. Thought you never asked. I know, right? <laughs> Should have you been? A little special. Nah, um, I'm straight. Like, uh, family, kids, you know, normal stress. Hey, normal stress. Gotta <laughs> love them, but you know, at the end of the day, you gotta do what you gotta do. Yep. Um, trying to build other um, avenues and things that we've been working on. Mm-hmm. Uh, a, lot of, a lot of dope things that we're trying to work on, man. A lot of dope things coming. Um, that's why we just kind of moving things around. We're just trying to kind of get a feel for things right mm-hmm. now. But we, you know, I'm, I'm in some dope conversations uh-huh. with some dope people. Yeah. Um, okay. I think it's going to be beneficial for all of us, man. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah. Yeah. We all all right. just trying to make it right. in this, uh, this crazy world crazy that we live world. in. Wait, in the stream. Oh my God, bro. Oh yeah. I was oh, waiting. Yeah. I didn't want to say nothing because he was saying stream. I'm like, all right, so we, gotta, we gotta talk about the stream, man. Segway. Because I meant to ask about that when y'all finally, was doing. <laughs> finally got on Twitch, man. Yep. We finally yep. uh, getting active, and I mean the support of people that we've been getting so far, bro. It's yeah, crazy. Just second stream. Just crazy. So I can only imagine where it's gonna take us. Uh, we're trying to, you know, schedule a consistent time that where we. You know, always streaming and stuff like that. Like, it's fun. Yeah, you know, it's, it's like the best job ever, you know. And, you know, you're just trying to soak it in but while remaining humble. But I think it's going to open up some dope opportunities for us, some oh, dope collabs. Oh, yeah. It's about to go crazy. Yep. Uh, the Modern uh, Warfare 2 trailer dropped or whatnot earlier. Um, they just showed, like, the rendered footage. They ain't showing, like, no gameplay. But that's going to be the game. Oh, People, yeah. 
everything. Yeah, and I heard so that, many man. details on it. So, I was literally yeah. looking, listening to that at work. I was at work. I was like, okay, so what's the new details? They was mm-hmm. like, yeah, you can open up a tank from this side. You can do mm-hmm. this. You just, I was like, oh, okay. Well, I'll be there. Yeah. <laughs> so you already know what we're going to be Sign me up. Yeah, Modern Warfare <laughs> you know 2 yes, is sir. going to be the game. And then I believe they dropped in Warzone 2 yep. and later on, which man. we all know. Yeah, that's gonna be fucking. We gotta do. That's a, where we gotta I'll do be. A, uh, yeah, a stream with the homies, bro. Yeah, man. That's it's only be fun, right. Bro. You know, nope. that's going. Hopefully, to we can get Demond in there again, man. <laughs> Good times to just leave us. I can say, <laughs> Activision, they were really the timing when Warzone dropped and then COVID happened. It, it worked it, for it them worked. so it worked. well. Almost like they knew. <laughs> I I wouldn't be surprised. Import X Files theme song. Like Warzone didn't drop yep. until right around COVID started, and everybody was on a lockdown, so everybody was playing Warzone. Game. Warzone I mean, in school, everybody nope. was playing Warzone, <laughs> and it was one of those things where it was lightning in a bottle, and they knew yep. they had it. They knew they had it. People was buying camos, skins, beat people on there all day, all night, because you couldn't go nowhere. So nice. what you doing? Hey, you hopping on Warzone? Let's all day and all night, night, man. Let's get it. That Hop shit it was, on. And that shit was fun. I mean, bro. I became a professional gamer for like three months. That right? shit Playing was the game. so fun. But it was like, fun, man, bro. It, it, was like, fun. it was like, you know, of course, a lot going on in the world. So yeah. don't, don't get it twisted. That was your like, peaceful place. That was your, oh, yeah. that was your way. Was. Your sanctuary. Yep. When you went to Verdansk. It, it was it was man it, i miss for it, it, it was able to get you away from all the bs Burnets. that was happening in the world people not wanting to wear Burnets. masks and all this other yep. stuff and us for the states and you know people that stayed in the united states us only giving like two stimulus packages and they were barely oh, worth anything i don't even want to talk yeah, about those because no. then you gotta you have to pay the fucking shit back and yeah, i believe it that's why these gas prices going yeah. up yeah. you gotta pay it back no no we're gonna yes. yeah we're gonna we're gonna get ours back really yes when they come out the taxes, taxes? oh well, yeah, so yep. my shit came straight off a tax i was like as soon oh, as thanks. i fought that's the first thing oh did you uh <laughs> did you get a stimulus check this year added it to my tab yeah i didn't ask for it i don't want it now i don't want no more i gave it to the shit i didn't i didn't check yes shit but it's happened I'm, to pop up in my account. It, but I know. think you have to deny it. I'm sorry, y'all, but I'm trying to adjust my mic. But yeah, um, with the stimulus, yeah, you have to pay that back. But we wasn't tripping because we already, we already got to add it. <laughs> add it to the tab. Go ahead. It's, add it to yeah. the tab. Don't let it, it fool you, man. That's is. why these all these prices are going up. <sighs> yeah. They're trying to get that to back. Mic. Yeah, so. of course. But um, we got an interesting story real quick. <laughs> Definitely. We had to cut because the mics was tripping, but, you know, we should be good now. You good? <laughs> Shit, I'm trying to say, hopefully mine's good. All right, there we go. You're good. All righty. Yeah. yeah. All right. <laughs> we got to talk about this one. This, <laughs> he said, this no. is a, a he classic, said, let it, let it, let it classic one. If go. he doesn't mind sharing. I still don't. Y'all I didn't don't. even ask me. Yeah, y'all just, you know. We just gonna talk. We can all we, we can all we can all get to some personal <laughs> questions. Should we all have I questions for each other? Like that, bro. That's fair. A lot of personal questions I for like, each other. We'll, I hate we'll make this like a that. personal yeah, thing. <laughs> I, I go down, y'all going with me. All right, what's what, the, why, y'all, y'all signed down? up. Hey, I'll, I'll feed off your story. No, since, hey, don't do no crime with me. Cut off shit. my story anyway. Don't we not gonna do no crime with you? Actually, we've been in an almost situation before. So you nut, see now you got me thinking. When you, the, you oh, you still, you all right? Because I was an innocent boy. So I, I was at home. Story exactly. Up I was at home playing Xbox. And they, you, they you was hoodlums playing called me. Hoodlums, okay. okay. Hoodlums. Oh, that's kind of racist, right? See, because we black. You had one light skin hoodlum and, and the uh, darker skin hoodlum. Yep. It's a black thing. See. Okay. Okay. But you was from Overbrook. That's crazy. Exactly. And I was trying to change my life in Pearland. He said some hoodlums. Hey man, we just got some. We got these BB guns, man. Some hoodlums. Brandon nutted up in front of the police. They bro. weren't no hood. <laughs> Technically, we all did. You all, no, I dropped. But I'm, I maybe. Them. Why do we see? We dropped them, we, and then we, we all we said, we "I remember nothing." No, we all said, "Okay, except so for Lionel." I'm gonna put it in context. So we was in the in Pearland one night. Yep. I don't know why. No, no, you know why? It was. We'll, we'll get to that. We'll get to that. I just want to. We ain't even gonna get the whole story. We just gonna do the the main part. Yeah. So we in Pearland shooting BB guns at night. Mm-hmm. Y'all why? foolish as hell. I don't know. Course, Very foolish. Yeah. But we didn't know. We wasn't from Pearland. We didn't know the whole the rules or anything. I don't shoot BB well, guns. Why? Barely. Oh, keeps in this happens. But so anywho, okay. um, <laughs> we all in the just in the dark. So apparently, some police that came up and they was actually walking to the park because we was already you know mm-hmm. just out there shooting. Somebody called, of course. Yeah. So um, he <laughs> was sense. walking with his hand on his hip, and oh, white mm. police. And when we seen him. 
we was coming, we was already walking back to the car because we was done. So we seen them walking up and immediately everybody that was out there except Brandon <laughs> just threw their gun in the, in the, in the grass. Like, it was just like, ah. damn. This nigga was he holding on it. to it on some, what do I do with it, bro? What do I do with it? Bro. I was like, bro, we could have got shot. <laughs> like, point blank. And he was holding, we was like, Brandon, throw the shit. Like, <laughs> throw it on the ground. already knew we had the guns, dog, which I granted that. He made me so Brandon mad. Brandon panicked like a motherfucker. Like, I was like, bro, <laughs> he like. froze. His hand just glued to the gun. He told, what do I do? And then he waving, what do I do with it? Oh, I'm like, bro, it's funny, it's but shit. it's not, because it's like, it's, that's yeah. how people get shot, for real. Yeah, like, that's I mean, really, how they get shot. Which is crazy, because we, now we look back that. Look yeah. back at yeah, him, looking back, bro. it did. Yeah, it definitely he was didn't cool. age well. Yeah, he yeah, was cool. With it. Like, yeah, of yeah. course, he wasn't once cool. he you'd be him. surprised how many you run into. That's cool as hell. But what happened was he actually yeah. looked in the cars and he seen the BB gun rappers mm. in the car because he noticed the vehicles at the park. We was on the cars parked there, yeah. so he seen the rappers in the car. He knew mm. who he was already up to, so mm. he was just trying to make sure we wasn't no. You know, yeah. knucklehead, knuckleheads. I mean, we was knuckleheads, but but not, not, not yeah. 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 really just doing some yeah. shit. He knew we wasn't. Definitely can't do that now. Yeah, yeah. At all. Definitely can't. Yeah, can't. Definitely can't commit a crime with Brandon yeah. either. Because definitely not. That's <laughs> why I don't. That's why I don't do crime. Shit. That's why he said. That's shit. why I stay out. The, I stay out. You damn right. I'm productive citizen. Damn. But anywho, shit. we're gonna get to the real story. But anyway, they said they all said what guns. And they said, nah, don't, don't. The cops like, nah, nah, don't, don't, don't play that with me, man. We heard them and stuff. How you I'm slide like, to that part? Why no? Because nah, you me, got on me. I gotta get on y'all. Tell me the part. Lionel, surprisingly, shout out to Lionel. You were the most logical one that night because you said we all threw them away because we didn't want say? y'all to say yeah, why? Because they already heard them. We what, were popping them right there. They what, heard the guns. What we supposed to say? You were like, what guns? I'm like, no, the y'all cop knew to what y'all <laughs> gonna say too. Huh? The cop huh? knew we y'all had, had a talk head. right before the cop came up, huh? No, no, mm-hmm. we all said so Everybody, we, we all froze in a way. Senses. All I know is when somebody says what guns, I say what gun too. Like yeah. you're just supposed to go with the group. Steve, nigga senses, right? <laughs> Bro, <laughs> you go with the group, Brad. Lionel was the only one that was like, "No, nah, we threw him down because First we didn't want y'all." You go with the group, so, Brad. I'm so mad that Brandon bro. is sliding to that part. <laughs> no, we all part. we all had some some. We're, we're still on the part to where you had the gun in your hand and you didn't drop it. Right, yeah, exactly. And that was not, that was my 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 failure. That's it. That's, so, that's the failure. Nah, hey, hey, it wasn't. Fun. We we still here. Technically, ain't nobody failed. All right, well, that's true. So tell God, hey, we all here. You say it's a W in my eyes. Got that. So. So if we would have got shot, don't we say you've been whooping your ass in the afterlife. Can't do it on the past, <laughs> man. Because you heard him right talking. Well, we here. Like you can't don't say do that, that man. Now. Don't, don't bring that violence to the Lord's kingdom, man. <laughs> this dude. Yeah. I'll give you one I was wrong. at home playing San Andreas and they want to play San Andreas in real life. I'll damn give it. you one round. Shit. They had just turned 18. <laughs> he said, I'll give like, you one round. Oh, so y'all were seniors too. Oh. Yeah, they were young. Like we just was, I think we had just graduated. They had just turned uh, was summer of our graduation or yeah. something like that, probably. And I already had a BB gun and I stuff. I think I was then. just down, too. Hmm, you did. And y'all, yeah, I did, yeah. I didn't have no rappers and stuff. Nah. nah, it was, um... I don't remember. It was that park. Uh, oh, the I pavilion I, I remember what it looked like. It had yeah, houses around it. Yeah. It, all I know is it was a park and it had houses around it. Yeah. I know exactly which park. So, um, um, the Independence. I and it had lights. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Wait, yeah. was it? No, I don't think it was Independence. Shit, what's the name? That's where we hooped at. You yeah, that's what I'm thinking. It's a, no, it's a basketball no, no. Field. it was it, had, it has a basketball court. I don't think it was but too it's, far. It's next to a baseball field too. It's um. I know what you're talking about. I, I don't. I can't think about. of no other. It's not next to the Rex and nothing like that. Couldn't but, put the gun down. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty, pretty sure I know what you're talking about. <laughs> so, well, you guys are here. You know what's funny though? That's all that matters. That same <laughs> cop arrested my uh friend like I think a couple weeks later. Oh For damn! Real? Yeah, the same white cop. Wow. wow. No, it was a Mexican cop and it was a white cop. I was like. I don't know if he recognized me stuff. I was like, damn, I don't hope he didn't. I was like, God damn, motherfucker, you the same. Like, <laughs> you back in some shit? Yep. You back in some shit. I thought uh, you learned your lesson. Guess I gotta take him down to the yep. station, boys. <laughs> Wait, I didn't even do nothing. Wait a no, minute. No, listen, see my friend, got, my friends. They got the warning. You get the, the cuffs. <laughs> yep. But yeah. Teach this one here a lesson. <laughs> so we brought that up for her. To, to go into the next story. I mean, if it's okay with you. A non relatable <laughs> story. <laughs> No, we had to make a point because you talk, start talking about personals and then. Yeah. Like, no cost you know. Well, this could work so in Brandon's favor, man. Is that, you live and you learn. You live and you learn. Because, you know, uh, you know. You live and you learn in life. He was a good Samaritan at that time. So I was. I was a good know. Samaritan both nights. Okay. Exactly. All right, All right so, so let's so, hear so, so, Let's, happy, let's hear your good deeds. Go yeah. ahead. Exactly. Let the world know. She probably listening too. All right. Well, that makes it even better. So you don't want to talk about it? You go ahead. No, you want to. I ain't say who's way. <laughs> you ain't. You want to? Like, 
I don't know how this brought how this was brought up. Because we right. said we was going to talk tell about the it off story. Air. I think he nervous. <laughs> well, I ain't nervous, but I'm like, bro, I, I, bad I, of a story. I pleaded my case for years. When Dub was his top friend, he ain't gonna let you. <laughs> just, nah. just tell us opportunity, so we can hear, and we can, you know, you can get the clutch squad to to, yeah. to judge you in the comment section. Well, I will say this, right, Mr. Mr. Henry. Do you want to start it off? Brandon's a great person. I am. No, he's a great person. I am. It's just in this situation. In this situation, yeah. I just it just don't you know how things don't add up to how like it don't sit are, well with you. Yeah, it just didn't it didn't make I don't know. I just think your attentions may have been To be honest, okay. I see where you're going there, but honestly that wasn't my attention. Really? Right. No, nah, honestly it was just it was just like I right, had a well, good tell heart. Story, then. Tell, tell the story, story, bro. All right, Wait. once again, this is about five years ago. Okay, okay. I was leaving, you know, coincidentally, I was leaving, you know, Dub's house. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know if we were printing shirts or I don't know what we were doing. Probably some VOD stuff Hustling or whatever. Somehow. Hustling, yeah, it was the weekend, of course, leaving the house around maybe like 2, 2.30. You know, I'm driving home and then, bam, you know, I'm hitting Pearland. If y'all familiar with the Houston area, you know, you got Cullen, then it turns into Pearland, you know, time mm -hmm. being sparked. Uh -huh. Once again, it's like 2.30. I'm driving ahead. That's when I had my white, you know, pickup truck. I see in the shadow. I see like a shadow figure, you know, that's walking. One red flag. Usually, <laughs> that's a red flag for someone that sees you. <laughs> anyway, like I said, it's around two thirty. I see like a shadow figure, you know, walking. <laughs> Usually around that time in Pearland. So at this time, you're going south towards Pearland. Yeah, and it's like uh, thirty miles per hour. Yeah, it's around uh, uh, Dawson Middle School, <laughs> Dawson like uh, Dawson High officer. School. Yeah, right. Thirty miles per hour. Yeah, mm -hmm. okay. I'm chilling, cruising. And all of a sudden, you know, as you know, I'm driving close to it. You know, it's like it's a woman. You know, it's a you know, it's a young black lady and she looks, you know, like frightened. Mm -hmm. And she's, you know, she's pacing, she's walking fast and stuff. Of course I drive past her. Right. At 30 those, miles per hour? Yeah, or whatever. Still 30. <laughs> He's so stupid. Now in my head, I was like, bro, there is never a black woman walking like in Pearland at this time of night. Yeah, like true. she looks scared and stuff. It's, it's not. Scary. So, yeah, you know, I was like, damn, you know, is she okay or whatnot? Now, of course, my first instinct I was like, you know, nah, I, like I don't want to pick up nobody like that yeah but i was like damn maybe it's probably like a good deed because she looks scared or whatnot so so question so how you know how scared she look so were you going like maybe 20 miles because i was looking look why you look at because <laughs> in order to see somebody's face you got to be driving a little slow i was on the regular maybe like 30 35 whatever okay. the speed was the, i'm probably going slower because them cops you and know she was on the left side or the right side she was on the right side like okay, i was so driving he, she was right here she so there, I, yeah she right was side. she was walking you know oh, okay, out of so like yeah. okay. Okay, okay, so, okay. Okay. and when i drive i'm looking at her, she looked frightened and i was so like she was on your left side then if you was driving into Pearland. no no oh. i like i'm driving into she Pearland. Was walking she was on the wrong side like yeah. this is dawson high school she was right here on the sidewalk walking this way i'm going yeah i got you and i was like once again all that lingered in my mind is like man it's like midnight two o'clock Black woman don't be walking like this in parallel yeah. like that. They so do I'm like, know. man, is she okay? I've never seen. Trust me. <laughs> it depends on the part. If, yeah. if you're in old parallel hell, no. If you're in like newer parallel, well, that's hell. like mid. That's like yeah, going yeah somewhere. That's, that's still kind of mid newer. Parallel yeah. Or hell. regardless, I've never seen. I'm like, damn, like is she good. So anyway, you know, I turn the corner. I'm like, man, maybe she yeah, needs a ride or something. Because your first instinct was like, nah, hell no. Nah. No, yeah. first he was like, nah. But then, you know, once again, my conscience kicks in. I'm like, maybe she needs Brandon, help. Sure enough, she check did. Check on her, Brandon. Maybe she needs or your did you assistance. Look in the, or did you look in the rear view and see something? Ross is Brandon. No, honestly, I, it, the, <laughs> the good side. The, no, I, I didn't see none of that. I got you. So, okay, so I'm. Right. So, anyway, no, I turn I'm around. I was like, I'm like, ma'am. And then she. Paranoid side. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. And I'm like, I'm talking. I'm like, ma'am, are you good? Do you need help or anything? And like, she kept walking like she's just. And then next thing you know, I'm like, okay. So I started, you know, like driving off a little bit. She was like, she was like, uh, yes, He's yes, I do. She's like, I need, I, I need a ride. I just, anyway, she just got out, you know, or like jail. Oh. So I was like, did she, she show you that? Right yeah, she was coming. From, she, she, she Two the red court, flags. The courthouse. Before oh, wow. she got And I was like, car. damn, she's like, yes, oh my God, like I need a, uh, I just got out, you know, got out of jail. You know, my, my, all my kids, you know, are at, you know, my grandparents' house. So I was like, three red flags. Um, <laughs> damn. Sheesh. Now, yes, all, <laughs> shit. all that shit, I was like, you know, damn, okay, yeah, that's, <laughs> that's did she have her clothes in there? That's hand? a lot of red flags. Nah, she was, she had regular clothes and stuff. She didn't have no clothes in there? That's crazy. Nah, she had no clothes in hand and stuff. I was just like, damn. She had nothing. No, nah, nothing. And then at that point, I was like, "That's another red flag." Damn, I'm like, I can't really. Ex I could have, but I'm like, it's gonna make me feel more bad, so I can just peel off. Cause I'm like, uh. But then when she was telling me like, you know, the address on my her grandma, her her mom, parents stay at and stuff like that, she was explaining to me. I was like, yeah, that's cool. You know, she's like, 
Like, look, I'm a good girl. I'm not into none of stuff. I'm like, Wait, no, 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 no. This is when she got in the truck. Now, before she got in the car, she before she got in the car, she's like, I'm a good girl. I'm not out here trying to. I'm like, no, 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 ain't nothing like that. It's like, if you need help, you know, I, I can take you. You know. And so anyway, you know, I took her, you know, we started chopping it up and like her story was Where what wait, where was the location where she was going? Like uh Flamingo. Flamingo and like MLK, yeah, multiple it's red flags. Five. I know. Yes, yeah, five. See, like just have the notifications, yeah. That's the uh, red flag. So by now it's like <laughs> maybe count. Exactly. It's probably three o'clock. So I was like, damn, okay, you know. And she was telling me like in how an intruder, yeah, it was in the morning. Three o'clock in the morning. Yeah, a intruder came into her house. Okay. And, you know, she shot at him and like when she when he ran out. He, you know, that's why she was in jail. She was in jail. She six, shot. She ran six. outside and started shoot, trying to shoot. Oh yeah, once you do that, and then bam, that's yeah. when you know the cops oh, came and arrested her. Run out. Basically, yeah. she was in jail because she was trying to protect her and her kids. Cause it was like a robber, like right. a home invasion. So I'm like, damn, oh. okay. So anyway, I drove, you know, and we made it to that's her grandparents' house. Her, her. So hearing that story, you just like, damn, that's crazy. Yeah, it's right. crazy. Yeah, damn. like I said, I'm like, damn, you know, that's scared. I mean, <laughs> I mean, shit. I mean, it's. Frightening, but I'm like, damn. I'm okay. here already. So yeah, I mean, already committed. Might as well commit. If I'm anything, committed. I was the fact that you know she had she had you know kids and whatnot. I was like, you know, right. damn, you know, I feel like okay, I'm helping. Yes, it was stupid, you know, but then again, I mean, I mean you, it's you, just you, you know, being a good citizen. Hey, bro. no, you yeah, were. exactly. Oh, you, I don't, I don't, I don't think you right understand. Place. Right. Yeah. Everything about your story and what you did is phenomenal. No, it's yeah. It's I mean, it's, it's rare. I never. Yeah, that's it's definitely just so now. Yeah, nowadays, yeah, no. So anyway, um, made it to her parents' house and stuff. It's like, oh, thank you so much, you know, so and so. You know, we exchanged over. I was like, you know, no, nah, no problem. It's like I don't have no money right now. I'm like, no, 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 you good, you good. You know, I'm just happy to help and whatnot. And then her mom like waved at me and stuff. She's like, thank you so much, so and so, because it would have took her a long time, you know, for a period. Yeah, like, I'm about to say to South yeah, Park. Yeah, exactly, maybe. South Park, really. Yeah, stuff, no, so that's a walk. Wasn't no car outside when you pulled up? Not just her parents' car. Hmm. So hmm. I mean. It, I ain't think about. See, look, don't, I'm don't. Just, I'm, just, I'm here. All right, I'm, I'm, I made it. Cause that would have been like the first thing. No, correct. Yeah. She didn't. Uh, no, nah, she didn't have a phone. That's right. She didn't. Her phone was dead or something. Cause her phone died in the, in the. Well, maybe she, I don't know. It was like they. Her. She's like as little. I guess the courthouse literally when they dismissed her, she didn't want to wait or nothing like that. And mm -hmm. like so, matter of fact, she used my phone. Now I remember. Now I'm thinking more about it. Mm -hmm. She used oh. my phone. You know, she called twice because they That's didn't recognize my number. Yeah, and so you know, bam. I'm just so glad we got one thing. Yeah, but, yeah. So yeah, that's the, I'm saying. You want to do that more nowadays? Nowadays, it's just yeah, so it's hard just, because like, you never know. Definitely, you never yeah. somebody trying to set you up. Yeah. If it's, yeah, you know, it's a leak or something like that. Because we didn't have yeah. some homies that actually, mm -hmm. you know, almost got robbed because they meeting people online and yeah, stuff no, like that. I've never done. You think you meeting up with somebody and then they got you know other intentions going on? See so, you walking, hey bro, get that cardio in. <laughs> that's it's it's sad to be like that. Now, Damn, that's, you, you will leave so that cardio in. Get that cardio in because mm -hmm. health is wealth. Because, nah, because of how mean. crazy nah, people for real. Are. Yeah. Because it could have been flipped on you, like mm -hmm. oh, this man trying to you know. Yep. Like, yeah, too. nah. That's and I ain't gonna lie, the the way that people are making the climbing nowadays, which is I'm very glad we brought this up because it kind of goes with so many topics. Yeah, yeah. but the way they making the climbing nowadays. Most dudes kind of choose not to help sometimes no. nah, because yeah. yeah, that's true. It's like yeah. either you gonna say you gonna flip it and say I did something, or you gonna put me in the mm -hmm. middle of something with you and a crazy dude. Yeah, yeah. nah, exactly. I, yeah, I, yeah, that's that's shit. Honestly, today I, you know, I, I nigga, couldn't do that. Now when she got kids, you know, like you know, you yeah, got, I'm sure they got fathers or a father. So it's like, mm -hmm. oh man, who who is this whoopty whoop or you know who yeah. you this dude you riding with? It's three in the morning. What if he ain't trying to buy the story? You know what I'm saying? Like it's just yeah. It's so nah, many it things. can it can be like that. Nah, I mean, and it's funny you bring it up because you know I continue to you know keep in touch with our girl, and that's when you know we became yeah. you know like friends, you know a little bit, you know more than that, and then oh, so oh. I somewhat. I somewhat like you know. Who's that lady? I'm gonna sip to that. Devil didn't want to. Didn't want to like. Wait, 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 wait. He don't know. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, he don't. Yeah, Steve don't know. Oh, okay. Well, so this turned into a Ooh. more than. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It was a save from the pickup. Yeah. yeah, it was the a kids, pickup. All right. And then the kids were the kids in up. the middle of Martin Luther King on Flamingo. Wasn't the red flag enough to not continue? Look, like I said, this was five years ago. All right. It's not that That's when I met Ross. Yep. <laughs> oh, bro. Yep. What you mean? I met five years ago. I oh, met oh the yeah, same yeah. Time. That wasn't that long ago. That's funny. <laughs> anyway, look, mentally, five <laughs> years ago. Like, <laughs> he say mentally. So how did that conversation it's all about go from 
Hey, thanks to y'all texting each other on the <laughs> regular. To, ooh. Yeah, to the slide through. How how did that process how did go? That, I need to hear that. I want to know. I actually <laughs> never don't know the process of it. How it went from I'm just to the pickup no, to no. the actual. Hey, you know. Thanks. She she had added me on Facebook. Okay. And then uh, Facebook route. went from there and stuff. She's like, uh, when you was Yeah, I want to thank you again, so and so. And I was mm-hmm. like, Oh yeah, no problem. And um. She kept, you know, saying, you know, oh, you know, I'm handsome, this and that, and the third. Okay. That's what it was. And stuff. And but I was like, you, you know, were biting. Like, you were just chilling. Oh, she real you, you in. Like no, I was just, you know, just chilling. She real she real you in. Mm-hmm. She real okay. 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 Yeah. okay. Okay. She said, I need a good man in my what life. What you said? Out here picking me up. I was like, oh, yeah, appreciate it, so and so. And uh, she was like, some of my age and stuff. I was with. her back? No, I did. So I was like, I said, you know, appreciate it. You know, it was, honestly, I didn't fully know how she looked because it was still dark and whatnot. She got in the truck. Even still, I mean, it was hard. It was still dark. Like the only time we saw, like when, like when the lights, and she, she looked, look, she just got out the court. Though. You scaring me now, Brandon? What? <laughs> well, I didn't. Feel it was me. a blind it day. Was, okay? It was like it, it was. It was dark still. It so was literally a blind day. Seen yeah. the photos on Facebook, so I'm sure. He, yeah. Then when he I saw, I was like, yeah, I mean, she looked good and stuff, but like that still wasn't my intention. I was like, you know, mm. nah, I ain't trying to, you know. And then, but like, what pushed? Which switched the intention? She just makes so much yeah. more yeah. sense than why yeah. he kept asking what's, that question. Now, now I'm what, like, okay, now I don't just, seem like a jackass. <laughs> okay. What switched the intentions from I right, the pleasant little cute flirting to slide through? Man, she said <laughs> she had man, she put a uh, it was a face it was a Facebook it was a it was, it was, a, it was a post. <laughs> uh huh. And I was like, damn, what you mean by that? You know what she was? What was the post? Yeah, she was like, I need somebody to put this fire out, and I was just like. So you DM'd her. Oh, I was like, what you mean by so that? You like, so you so like, be the firefighter. So you responded from the post. Like, yeah. Oh, okay, okay. And I was like, oh, what does that you mean by that? And so she's like, I need, I need somebody to extinguish this. And I was like, <laughs> of course, I, my, man, the the point, I was like, I knew what she, yeah, I'm like, but. No, no, this is yeah. Brandon. I ain't want to be, you know, I'm like, yeah. you mean what I think you mean? Like, he had a Dalmatian and an axe. Yeah. Like, I'm ready. So I'm being damn. I mean, like she was like, said, "I'm coming to your call." No, nah, don't don't slide past that. So <laughs> no, I ain't mm-hmm. slide past So she said, "Red is handling it right." Yeah. She needs somebody yeah. to <laughs> to put this it. to mm-hmm. extinguish this. this. Yeah. So yeah. she kept. She wasn't. She was still like beating around the bush of exactly. Nah, until the third time, I said like exactly. Won't. Did you really get it or you didn't get? No, it? I I like I somewhat got it, but like but I don't want to. I don't want to. Yeah, I want to rather her to say it. So I don't want to just jump in and be like, oh, what the hell? Nah, what you mean? Yeah, good call, good call. And then when she went, you know, directly is what she. She went, you know, word by what word. I was like, was. oh, okay, yeah. And so, I mean, damn. So, what'd yeah. you say? He was like, she. I was like, she. Well, uh, she. I mean, hey, I mean, I can, I can be that guy. She was like, you know, maybe he, he. No. <laughs> Bam. So, not the he, he. Yeah. <laughs> not the he, so, he. Maybe. Yeah. So, after the maybe he, he, that's when you was like, all right, you picked a day to slide through, or she picked a day to slide through, or something. It was. I think she, damn, I, honestly, I mean, I do not remember that part. All I know is like I had pulled up to her house and then, you know, just bam. You yeah. remember, Brandon, but you don't got to say it on <laughs> <laughs> I was leaving your house again, bro. Oh. I was talking about Dub's house, man. I don't know. And she hit you up? Helps. Yeah, I don't know. Just and the, she was like, hey, what you doing? Slide through. Yeah. He was like, all right, cool. I'll slide through. I guess. Did, was it just right. straight into the nitty gritty? Nah, nah. We were just talking, just chopping talk, it up okay. and stuff, you know? like And then, and then yeah. She placed a hand on the thigh, huh? Man, I don't want to get too X-rated. I don't know the ratings on this podcast. She said the thigh. So she went straight to it. Huh? She, went, she grabbed the head. <laughs> <laughs> Grab the tip. Man, she didn't have to do nothing, really. I mean, so I like it. <laughs> yeah. Grab the Just tilt. picture Erica Badu. That's what she really looked like. Got the girl. Face and figure and all. Like, she, was, yeah. she was selling the, uh, the crystal the fragrance. <laughs> the fra- oh, oh, fragrance. <laughs> Now, she wasn't selling it like that, but you know, it was okay, spiritually, yeah, probably. Like, yeah. But, like, talk yeah. your talk, B. Anywho, but anyway, yeah. You know, we, we just, you know, we we're just friends. You know, me being having a good heart, you know. Mm-hmm. Friends that turn into morning yeah, friends. Got me yeah, yeah. some good cat. But anyway, <laughs> uh, yeah. I ain't gonna talk about. Yeah. Now, talking. We now we're just mutual face. Facebook friends. You now know, you she's in her own lane. You know, I'm in mine. You know, yeah. Now you mm-hmm. Yeah, she cool. She just, you know, has a. You ain't no, gotta go to it, yeah. but yeah. So you single and ready to mingle though, the pigs. Yeah. 
Basically, That's fair. Yeah. But he's not picking you up off the street. Nah, so you I ain't doing figure that. Out. No more of that. <laughs> got to meet you at a public place. No, not lights. at three in the morning, at least. <laughs> <laughs> with lights and people around. <laughs> exactly. No, I don't so. want to hear no more stories of Brandon telling me. Well, no, nah, ain't nothing like that. That's why I was telling you. I mean, once again, the other night I saw that woman. It was dark. I was like, nope, nah, I can't. Yeah, good man. Yeah, yeah, just, <laughs> I just want you to be safe. Oh, no, exactly. No, I, ain't, I ain't stupid like that. You know, I'm just get saying, you know, get him. Wait, no. <laughs> so many ways to get finesse in this day and age. Yep, it is. Yeah, no. yeah. Like That's I said, I like say. I said earlier uh, during the intermission, I said I had to when I did the the Good Samaritan thing and picked up somebody. It was because I seen him with a gas can, a boot on his foot. He had his daughter next to him, who actually wasn't his daughter. It ended up being his like niece or something. Mm, but damn. still, he was trying to walk all the way down this long road to get to this gas station. I knew the gas station was down the street, so I was right. like, Man, I can do that. I ain't got to right. drive far. I know where it's at. I kind of, <laughs> you know, because I'm kind of like on Dub's mindset when it comes to that kind of stuff. So I'm be like, kind of question it. But then I was like, ah, I can't. I yeah. can't just drive by this dude today. I just felt like I had to do it. So I was like, hey, come <laughs> on, come on, hop in the ride, blah, blah, blah. I feel like when your intentions is always really good, you, mm-hmm. you, you'll, you know, go yep. and put this protection around you. Yeah. For the most part, you know, yeah, man. For, the, for the most part. And it's just, you know, we joke about it, but it's just, it's it's so mixed nowadays, bro. It's oh, like it really is. So you much. Pick and choose. Yep. But mm-hmm. people, you know, and a, a lot of people trying to come up. Mm-hmm. Yep. We ain't talking about that part. Yeah, oh, you, oh, I see you on here. Ooh, ooh, let me. Uh, they can easily act like they don't know you at first. Yeah, yeah. and they'll throw some, pull some, you know, Man, for real. flip it on you and be like, oh, no, nah, you tried to touch me. Mm-hmm. And that's literally it. Like, sexual exactly. assault and misconduct can literally be ruled by the simplest thing that you you know, yep. they nope. could just claim it. You know, mm-hmm. so a lot of people, you just got to be careful out there, bro. That's all. No, for real. Yeah. Uh, for big real. facts. And uh, thank you for sharing that. that no, that story. was that was. A good I think it was story. funny though. Yeah, I mean, you, you want to thank yourself because you know you brought it up. I mean, yeah. I just you know, yeah. I mean, so, you had to tell. We it. asked your <laughs> approval. You had to tell. We got right. your approval <laughs> by force. But <laughs> there was no all right, man. Involved. Right. <laughs> you want to talk about it? Honestly, I didn't. But he brought it up. It was just funny just to think about it. Like I actually did it. This story might. You know, no, no, give you no. access to something you, else. Never. I mean, they had a, hey, people can just learn by it. I mean, Back. you know, I heard hey. your story on the, mm, the podcast. Mm. You're an inspiration. You don't oh, have hey, to well, pick me up, like, but I'm available. Trill Billy's an inspiration. There, go. there, you, there go. you go. You, know, you never there know. You right never know, man. Right. You never know. You can get a lot from this podcast, man. <laughs> With some wise so, men. How's it being like, single nowadays, though? Like for my single people. Yeah. How is it in the single world? It's real hazy. Are you see? It's, what? It's, <laughs> he's what? What you about to ask him? Yeah, Go ahead you just, I mean, I mean, like you, you're. He's like, so are you single? Actually, but I'm like, are you single? Said, are you single? single? I don't get no, it. I'm like, single. you're saying okay. Yeah. Like, it looked real hazy out the window, so I'm just trying to. Well, single. Let's okay. get us a that's clear. That's what. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Two. Uh, it's it's really it's complex to be honest with you it's more mm, complex yeah. than it should be only because of Explain. people's intentions <clears throat> and motives and how they move like mm. as you get older you know as men bro it's certain things where you just don't want to put up with well not even just men just people in general you don't want to yeah. put up with certain shit so yep. for example have I, you learned that lesson oh big facts i'm i don't even waste my time half the time bro mm. if it ain't like mm. the situation i was in uh recently or whatnot it was for the first time a non-toxic relationship and it was great it was cool now you know non-toxic. we broke it off wow. for different reasons you know but we're still cool we still communicate you mm-hmm. know what i'm saying and we you know we still care for each other and i'm okay with that we're still friends you know but after being in that situation it's like the bar for me is so high. Like, if I see any type of BS, whether it comes to how you present yourself on social media, I'm out. How you, uh, you know, how you act in hey, public, I'm out. Fun. How you handle your liquor, that's very important for me. Because if I'm in a public setting and you starting to get a little bit lit, but there's nothing wrong because usually I'm going to be the sober one because I'm driving or whatever. But if you start acting a little wild, doing extra stuff, drawing unnecessary attention, I don't like that. Mm. Like, I feel like we're adults. If you know you can't really handle your liquor like that, then you should probably chill on it. You know what I'm saying? So, so, so do any previous relationships meet the bar now? Uh, no. They, actually, they don't even come close, bro. Like, I'm, my I mean, mindset. They even coming close. Like, Ross how the I hell with y'all. Damn, <laughs> it's, it's all about, <laughs> you know what I'm saying, presenting yourself in, in a way where, for example, 
previous person, she met my mom. She met my dad. She met my stepmom. She met all my she friends. She did. I remember now. One of those things. Not everybody yeah. gonna meet the mom, dad, stepmom. She was going to not, <laughs> not everybody's gonna be on that type of time. So I gotta realistically think if. You around me, and you invest in time, and I'm investing time into you. Am I really gonna let you meet my parents? Mm. Am I really gonna let you be around my friends? Because yeah, these are the people I'm around all the time. They are an extension of me. So if they seeing something or whatnot, and they're not, you know, not really rocking with it. Granted, it's still my decision, mm -hmm. but that also affects the dynamic. So a lot of things go into factor when it comes to dating now. And I just once I see some BS, I'm like, I'm good. Uh, nah, I don't like the way you move. I don't like, you know, you can do whatever you want. I'm all for people doing and moving how they want, but I don't like the way you, like, put yourself out there. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, I'm, I'm not a big fan of that. And, you know, it's to each his own. So it's definitely more complex. And then you got to deal with certain people. Bless you. You got to deal with certain people uh, feeling like, Entitled before they even fucking know you, like nigga, I don't even know you. You ain't. See, I check all shit. that off, like before I even get to know somebody. I got, I can look at certain females talking on, to somebody. Oh yeah, right. well I'm not even talking to nobody in general, but I see it see all the time. Your eyes like the way your eyes squeaked. Right? I was like, he said that to somebody. You don't even know me. I mean, they don't know me. Nah, just, I'm not even talking to anybody. Mm, in, uh, you don't know me, like specifically. So that's how you feel. But I just see it all the time. So he's just not gonna acknowledge me. People feel. In, I saw uh, the pod. <laughs> entitled <laughs> to something that you are, something yep. that you do, or what you know, what you bring to the table. That's people in general, know though, bro, mm -hmm. family like that. It's just, it's, yeah, yeah, that's, that's true. why. People, yeah, that's true. But it's like it's more prevalent now, even dating wise, because now people just feel like, oh well, you know what I'm saying. I look good, so you gotta do this. I'm like, Man. nigga, there's a no, whole no. bunch of good looking women out there. I ain't gotta do shit for you. You know what I'm saying? Because I don't know you like that. You know, and it's also, you know, just being aware of, you know, self-worth. You know what I'm saying? That's, Having that's that, say. that's the real, real thing. Once mm -hmm. you have that, you start to see everybody else differently. Like, that was going to be my advice yes. to single people, bro. Like That's self-worth keeping for, that. For people who are single right now or looking for a relationship, man, I think the best thing is just being in tune with yourself, loving yourself, and just knowing your work. The best like, love is self love. I tell people that all being comfortable, the time. being comfortable, being by yourself, mm -hmm. yep. um, being you know doing things by yourself. Seven years know? strong, baby. And right. huh? You said be, be you know oh, be, yeah, yeah. be with yourself seven years has been like yeah that. like just just be in tune with becoming a better you every mm -hmm. day. Oh yeah. Um, so that way you don't have to uh, sacrifice and you know just. Go for whatever is out there. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Some people they they always seem to oh I'ma just settle for no, 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 no. you don't no. have to settle. The thing about knowing your worth too is it's it's easier to tell what fits for you immediately. Exactly. Like it's it's a lot easier. Like for me, it was it wasn't hard because it was like I was like your energy matches my energy. Your this matches me. This mm -hmm. matches me. I like this. This doesn't match me, but I can deal with that. Yeah. It's like there's mm -hmm. certain things that you're like, all right. What am I going to put up with? What am I not going to put up and with? And that's the key. Yeah. Right but, and, and are you going to continue to grow? Because me and my wife exactly. used to talk about this all the time. Like, I'm not going to sit here with you and both of us not trying to elevate mm -hmm. in all ways. Like, that's not yeah. fair. You know what I'm it's saying? Like, if I just get married and I'm just going to tell Nietzsche, like, oh, I'm going to just let myself go now. Like, I got you. That's not fair. Mm -hmm. And I tell her that all the time. I said, what if I just let it go? Don't care about nothing. I don't got no drive. I don't have no sense of motivation. No, no, no spark no more. Like if a dude, if the right dude come a coworker, whomever, mm -hmm. and just start talking to you every now and then, you're going to find yourself. Yep. Bro. And it's, it's more like more, more easier to, to, it's more easier for that to happen now. Exactly. I mean, so, but yeah, I, I couldn't be mad at that though. You know what I'm saying? Like, when people get cheated on sometimes, Makes sense, yeah. they look like, <laughs> it's like, bro, like, first of all, where are you doing everything in your relationship? I'm, I'm tired of that whole, oh, we married, though. It, nah, damn that. That shit yeah. don't work so they'll do what's I don't subscribe uh, to that no more. Know. No, I don't subscribe to that, bro. Like, yeah. I feel like it's, it's a it's a nonstop, a 24-7 job. Work. And yeah. you should always constantly be trying to look out for one another, you know, yeah. have each other's back. Just being married is not good enough. No, no, and that's that's kind of what people like to do, and they like to say that. That's why I'll be trying to tell all the people that's about to get married and everything be very careful right now because it's like women will take advantage, or men, anyone, mm -hmm. men or woman, may take that person you with might be taking advantage of who you are 
what your resources are, your family, just one children, just knowing that you got a certain background. So oh, I want a kid by this type of person. Mm-hmm. Like, bro, that's not the type of we ain't no damn robots. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We humans at the end of the day. So yep. don't ever think being married is just being that's it. Oh, I'm married. Exactly. Because a lot of the times when people get married, they get complacent and when that with that complacency, it that comes like the, the stop of growth like he was speaking on. Yeah. And so like let's say when Kess met me, I was working out all the time. I was doing this, 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 and this. And then I just all of a sudden just said, Nah, I don't want to do any of this stuff. I'm just gonna sit at the house and <laughs> just uh chill and not do anything else that mm-hmm. helps me grow mentally, physically, and all those other ways of growing. Thanks. Right. <laughs> Like uh, eventually she's just gonna lose interest. Like as a like, like as a human, you just that's normal. Start to, Cause that's who you like. You knew who you you got with, and you you knew that was the person you wanted to build with. If they're not mm-hmm. trying to build with you, then it's like, and you put them yeah. in a situation. Let me ask bro. the parents this: like, with having kids, like, is it a difference? Like when it comes to that? Cause I get the whole you know. Let's say if like you know we stop stop keeping myself together, whatnot, you know. And but I'm still a good father or a good mother. Like how was that? Some Prime things. example. And I knew I was eventually bringing this up. I'm watching Stranger Things, you know. Finally, yeah, I'm on well, third season. Oh, hold on, no, I'm getting to, I'm getting to it. No, because I want to see how you said. No, that. because there's a there's a scene where man, I can't think of the, the character, but you know, it's like the hot mom or whatever. Yeah, she ends up she's thinking about sleeping with Billy. Yeah, uh-huh. yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, then yeah, all yeah. of a sudden, you know, you saw the father. He's kind of like a slum. He's like lousy. But as soon as she's about to go, and, you know, do her mm-hmm. dirty deeds. She mm-hmm. sees him, you know, like asleep with like the the, the youngest daughter, yeah, like take yeah, care, yeah, yeah, yeah. and so she backs out of it. Uh-huh. So that's basically that's what I was getting at. So nah, like, yeah, sometimes that play a huge part as well. Sometimes like, it can be a reminder, like yeah, exactly, of, of the person that you got with for like the reasons. Like, mm-hmm. yeah. the kid can be born, and then if you see that that husband, not not just elevate as a husband, but elevate as a father, yeah. there we and go. Like, yeah. like he's a good good father. Like you start right. seeing that, or she's a good good wife. Mm-hmm. I mean, good good mother. Mm-hmm. Like you start seeing that type of stuff, you like, dang, I don't want just anybody. Around my kid, like you, and mm-hmm. you seeing these things. That's true. You yeah. have to think that's about. a very strong point too. Because yep. it will, it will. I ain't gonna lie, it will hold you back from making a uh, an abrupt decision. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but it won't hold it for long, like forever. Yeah, I won't yeah, say because true. I yeah. feel like growing up, if children grow up in a household where they can feel the disconnect. I feel like that's worse than just cutting it off, you know, cutting your ties. I agree. Makes sense. You know, yeah. sometimes you do, people, <clears throat> think about it, bro. You've heard plenty of stories from people that parents kept it together while they was kids, but the kids could tell that they oh, yeah. didn't have, yeah. like, mm-hmm. love. Or they can hear the shit. arguments or see yeah. the It's like yeah. a miserable sure, house. I heard kids say my mom and dad hate each other type stuff. Yeah, no facts. Mm-hmm. So imagine yeah. growing oh, up, yeah. bro, it's like, bro, I'd rather y'all not be here together. Yeah. Like, it's worse that I have to grow up with all this arguing and, you know, no telling what kind of abuse and stuff that mm-hmm. may come from that. And that'll mess up a kid, you know, for their life. Mm-hmm. So sometimes, I mean, it, it will stop you from just being like, oh, I'm out of here. You know, because you are thinking about the children. That's like, mm-hmm. that's like a big thing. But yeah, it's just one of them things that's not going to hold it forever. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep. So. If that's the only thing that's holding it together. Yeah. If that's at, the only at the thing. end of the day, like if, it's, if, you know, it's just, oh, she's watching the kids, but our relationship is trash. Like, yeah, that yeah. only do so much. Yeah, I heard that recently from someone. Uh, she um was married to her husband, with the the marriage was just shit, and she said she was only married until her daughter graduated. Damn, I've heard, man. There's a lot of uh when people I, that I've, I've I've heard about. Was, oh, yeah, damn. I thought you know, damn. she held it in well, but she said I did it for the children. That was her biggest thing. She said I did it for the kids. Strictly, and some man. people do that. I could yeah, live that's like sad. that, though, bro. Yeah, that's you know, very I, I sad. seen it like a man. I don't know if one of y'all posted it or something, but it was basically saying, "Make sure your house is not a prison." Mm-hmm. So, mm-hmm. so that's I was right. like, "Yeah, that's, that's facts. That's, yeah. A, that's a real, real statement." Exactly. You know what I'm, saying? So. I'm pretty sure I posted something similar to that. So Probably from I don't I don't know who I who who I saw it. I don't know if I was on Instagram or Facebook, but I was like, "Man, yeah, it definitely makes sense." Yeah, because that's that's a scary thing, bro. Like, mm-hmm. just you know, you you don't get multiple lives, so. No. I'm trying to be as happy as possible. Exactly. And enjoy it every step of the way. Right. You want to enjoy that with somebody. So yeah. if you're not with it, with somebody, bro, y'all really could just be using this time to grow, develop, mm-hmm. get your finances in order. Be the person you're trying to be. Be yeah. the person you're trying to get yeah. your goals, yeah. get some goals under your belt. Yeah, yeah sure. Because I always tell them, like, bro, it's easy day now. I always joke like that because it's like, bro, you don't have to commit to anything you don't want to. Nope. And you can actually nope. see a lot of things before you even comment. Especially or talk now. To the Mm-hmm. I right, just like what's your Instagram? Just just to go see up oh, aspirin to aspirin to aspirin to aspirin. All right, it's cool. It's cool. Yeah, my it's cool. Intention, no, my like intentions that. is to 
potentially date you to marry yeah. you, then I don't want yeah. that to be the yeah. only thing you say. I only date life. to marry. I, like at one point, it was only I was only dating to marry. So that was like, ah, if I'm dating you, then that's what I'm. Right. Yeah. I mean, you would think, right, right. You, honestly, bro, you would think people would be on that type of time now. Yes, but. Because, like, we, we joked about the little exclusive conversations with, mm-hmm. you know, a lot of couples that we, you know, be hearing about. But it's mm-hmm. like, that's cool, bro. But it's like, what are we doing? Yeah, like. It's like a waste of time. Where are we going? <laughs> My point has yeah. always been this. What is the point of me only being able to be with you? I'm not going to claim you, but I can only just be with you. That is the most confusing shit I've ever heard. Yeah, it makes no bro. sense. But it's for who, if it's working for you, cool. But it's like. Yep. At the end of the day, when you get older, <laughs> that like, bring, it brings up the topic of uh, the the Lori Harvey stuff. With yeah, the, oh yeah, Michael B. B. Jordan. Jordan. Prime yeah. example is like I he's thirty five. Ten year gap. I he's thirty five. She's twenty. Yeah, I didn't yeah. know that yesterday. I was and like, so, damn. My thing is just like I'm not mad at either one yeah. personally because that's, I don't really give a shit. Yeah, but <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Sorry. I mean that's just the reality. I don't. Of course, but at the same time, it's just like. I would think you would establish these things early on in a relationship right. with what you want. Like yeah. that's where my confusion is. But I'm like, I mean, I don't know what the hell is going on behind the closed door. So you never know. know. Yeah, you never know. Some, Could have been something else. Something I have no else. Idea what it is. I mean, it's yeah. just one of them situations where people laughing, doing the old oh, Michael yeah. B. on their little commercial. At the game. Yeah. yeah, and they like, oh, he I'm like, he probably me. fine. And I'm like, he probably good. <laughs> he may- no, it's like we were saying. I mean, he was, he got ridiculed for that. For being with a white girl, no? yeah, and then all of a sudden he got with Lori Harvey and the band. But then, I mean, speaking apparently of that, he's been seen with another, another white, white girl, girl recently, and then they've been ridiculing. Uh, yeah, I'm name? like, uh, is it Bronny? 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 Oh yeah, yeah they did that. I mean, like, my, it's we never like, got to get on that shit when that after the prom, bro. Yeah. Bronny's That's his crazy. high school is what predominantly white. white. Yeah. His whole his whole entire life probably been around, you know. No white kids, you know, or you know, non black. Same thing. I want to say there was a picture of didn't I don't know if it's true. Didn't LeBron take someone to? He a, did. He went uh, to prom with a white girl. With a white girl. Yeah. LeBron, LeBron went with his yeah. girlfriend. No, his girlfriend, and he went to another prom with a white girl. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah, I've seen. There's photos of. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Yeah. yeah. So, so, but it's one of those things where this y'all go. I don't know how. Not so mine. Just, shit. You are no MJ all the way. I'm just I mean, playing, there's bro. already really stu- like people, people are having a big deal about that, but it like. There are there's already studies that it's gonna be like a within like what 20, 40, 20, Oh yeah, 50, yeah. There's gonna like be a majority mixed mixed. Uh, the majority people, will maybe. be mixed. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's like statistics. I'm like, who cares? Like, it's like, yeah, but the, the white kids, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> the kids, man. White people. You know, like, yeah. And uh, and uh, what's You're the black dude name? You're not my country. What's Dr. the black Umar? dude name? Oh. Umar. Yeah. yeah <laughs> oh my God. <bro. laughs> hey, they tried to catch him slipping. Yeah. After, uh, he is uh, trying to do anything in his power to like debunk. Any yeah. allegations, I'm like, Umar, just no. <laughs> Let it go, got bro. caught in 4K. No, it's regardless okay. of what you were doing, the fact that you were being happy associating with this, quote, unquote, like this snow devil, whatever the hell yeah, you be calling, yeah, yeah. you know, <laughs> white people. <laughs> See, I'm it's like, like I, I hear his conversation and I want to agree with him. But to an extent, you, but you pushing hate towards another race, race. exactly. Oh, you're all, part of the problem. Weird. All yeah. white people aren't bad, bro. exactly. Just you, like you, you got to separate, and all black people them. aren't good, exactly. So like, you got to stop that narrative, like, yeah. oh, you can't be with no white person. Oh, be with who you want. I mean, in this in this day and age, just living in America, I mean, you can't. You, you of course, you can, you can be pro black. You can be you know conscious of everything, but you can't like be. That type of hate like that. Yeah. You can't, you know, have this country regardless of soul, you know, filled with diversity. I yeah. mean, it's like, like who you want. Exactly. Yeah. Who you want. Like, bro, that's that's the crazy thing is we live in a time period where we're more connected than any time period before. Mm-hmm. So if you want to talk to someone that's ethnically different from you, yeah. go ahead. It's funny. We're more connected, but more disconnected at the same, yeah, time. At the same yeah, time. It's it crazy. It True. happens, yeah. So I mean, yeah, yeah, man. And before we end it off, we got to talk about this particular situation. It's actually messed up uh, the tragic shooter, uh, Trouble, uh, mm-hmm. the rapper. Yeah. The um, that whole situation, apparently, uh, he was talking to a chick. He was with a chick, and her ex uh, was the guy that uh, ended up uh, killing him. Uh, I believe I think they he had gotten to it. Or yeah, got yeah. to it. And I think he came over there while he was over there and. Uh, started shooting, and ended up shooting him, and you know, fatally injured him. Shame. And uh, he turned himself in. His mother, you know, being the voice of reason, uh, told him to go ahead, and turn himself in. But I, the bigger thing I want to talk about 
in this situation is niggas is on some sucky shit. Mm -hmm. That shit is lame, bro. Absolutely. At the end of the day, we say it all the time. You hear it all the time. There are plenty of women out there for you. There's plenty of opportunities to find new relationships. I get it. It may hurt that certain situation didn't go the way you wanted to. But the one thing you don't do is if this person moves on and and interacts with somebody else, you be on some hating shit towards that dude Mm -hmm. and try to hurt that dude or hurt the person you was with. Like, because that doesn't make the situation better. And that proves why y'all don't need to be with each other if the first thing you do is pull out a weapon. And I, because I've seen this on, I want to say I've seen this on Instagram. Oh, it was Facebook Live. Someone had posted on Instagram where I guess the dude was getting into it with his ex and she's, and he pulled up and he saw um, his ex with another guy, I guess, yeah, her yeah. boyfriend. And the dude was like, uh, I think he was, he had to pull the gun out. He's like, I'll shoot y'all. I'll shoot both of y'all. I'll kill both of y'all. On lie. Pulled out a gun and everything. Great, he didn't do it. Thank God he didn't do it. But he's over there threatening them. And it's like, bro, that don't make you look cool. That makes you look lame. Bro, that makes you look lame like, as hell. That makes you look Love like a can be loser, a very crazy, bro. dangerous ass thing if you it ain't mentally be. right up in the head, bro. Because yeah, a lot of people are not mentally right. Yeah, no, I mean, no, bro, like move on. What 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 does that do to you? That's some sucking mm-hmm. shit. And like, they quit to flash that gun. Bro. Yeah, bro. Oh, like, bro. what if that other that dude would pull out a gun and shot you dead before you even pulled those out? Clearly, you threatening him, so he probably would have got off. Because it seemed like, hey, I didn't know this dude was threatening me. We was just in the Yeah, table. because. Yep. just protecting myself. He you, aiming at me. In the time we live in, bro, you pull out a gun. If you ain't using it, best believe it, it's going to be some potential return fire. And that yep. person ain't going to be afraid to use it. Because if you pull it out, you might as well, you better be using it. Because like that they, shit is like, dumb. Like they teach you in a survival class. Yeah, if you, you pull, pull it out, out you, you better pull be it out to use, use it, bro. It, bro. And that shit is lame. I just wanted to talk about that because. We try to push positivity on this podcast of course, as much bro. as we possibly Thanks, can. Man. And this is not how men should be operating. At all, it sucks bro. that you deal with heartbreak. We all deal mm-hmm. with heartbreak. We all deal with these problems. But the one thing you don't do is go around trying to hurt somebody, scare somebody, intimidate somebody Thanks. after they can move on. Go and take care so of yourself, so my boy. Man. And so fellas, so man, so I mean, so just so sorry, y'all got to be careful, man. Uh, uh, you know, shacking up, you know, a female's house that you barely even know. And, that's and of course, it goes to women, too. You know, I mean, that's just, shit just do beyond dangerous, man. So, yep. I mean, it's just sad yeah. that how he, think he, apparently he was asleep, I want to say, oh, man, when it happened. Up, and bro. Buddy just started shooting through the door and, you know, hit him in the chest or whatnot. And, and it's just bro. stupid, man. Suck his shit, bro. Suck so, it, bro. That's some suck It's crazy. Shit, even though bro. my story was funny and stuff, but, like, yeah. look how, you know, it's somewhat how it, you know, related to this situation. That's why. So, <laughs> that's just why bam. Thing. Man. This podcast should get a mix of everything, you know, mm-hmm. life lessons, humor, just you know, reality, bro. So, reality. Yeah, exactly. yeah, I'm glad we can end on that note. Yep. But again, man, I just want y'all to be careful out there. Be Please safe. Be safe. Um, yeah. praying for everybody. Usually, yep. as always, because yes, thing is, bro, people just don't value life no more, bro. So nope. they really don't. Bro. That's why they think they can just go and bing. It's like crazy is becoming a norm now. And man, niggas not even crazy. scared. Of, I'm, niggas not scared to go to jail. It don't. Nope. That's like. the thing. It seems like they're not. I'm like, bro, it's like they I, want to I, go I be there. watching shit. I'm terrified. The hell, you on Instagram live and so I don't know, you just in jail, just chilling. It ain't even just the like, you know. just the people. It's like, bro, I could not imagine being in the small square box. No, nah, man. For for hours yeah. in a day with nothing else. You can only like, sleep so long, bro. That yeah. shit is terrifying. No, I'm good. I like my freedom. I'm exactly. straight. I, love I don't yeah, watch. I ain't trying prison. to be around all that testosterone. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you got niggas trying to get at you twenty four seven, fight you. Oh, shit, yeah, stupid. Man. Man. Booty you every day. Fuck Boxing that. for real, man. I, I sleep on my stomach, so it wouldn't work for me, bro. So. <laughs> Yeah. When boxing is your birthday I fun, can't. that is crazy. Exactly. Like, so, man, Brandon, that's why, once again, I don't do right crime. So, it man. is right there. So, <laughs> Brandon said, no, sir. No I crime for me. What do I do with the gun? Oh, he already oh. easy access. He ready. <laughs> ready. See? He ready. Hey, bunk buddy, you ready already. Hell nah. <laughs> see? That's Damn. why you would never see. Take off your shirt. <laughs> crime, crime free is the way to be. I, I know. I, I wouldn't make it in prison. I'm telling y'all. Y'all know I wouldn't. So, shit. Uh, yeah. You already came prepared, yeah. huh? You ready. Squeeze them together. <laughs> bro, it's funny. Editing the damn, if you laugh, you drop your soul. I was thinking of all that shit. I'm like, bro, like this shit, who comes up with the damn title? Somebody. But, like, 
I sleep on my stomach now. I do, man. Now that's the only way I can sleep. Yeah, like. That's the only way I can get rest. No. No, I couldn't. Turn over. Turn over. You know you tired. No. <laughs> Bro, see? You know you sleep. I couldn't, man. Turn over. Uh, you, you don't want to go to sleep? Or you ain't Me, sleeping, I don't man. know. I'll be the type probably for him, kind of like, I don't know, like a religious cult or something, man. You Bring the peace. <laughs> something. Shoot, whatever, whatever, whatever will work for me. Brother Brandon. Shit, Brother there we go. Brandon. Yeah. Brother uh, Brandon Muhammad Musa, whatever, <laughs> man. Like, shit. No disrespect to y'all religion, but I mean, it's anything. <laughs> You know, <laughs> on that note, on that note, don't do crime, kids. Don't Good do job. crime. Yeah, <laughs> stay out of go jail, to jail, my boy. Exactly. <laughs> Especially but, uh, if you sleep on your stomach. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> so, Especially if you sleep on your stomach. Yikes. Bro. Once again, if you ain't learn anything from this podcast, learn that, man. All right, man. Stay out of trouble, fellas. Right. Catch y'all in the next. Already. <laughs> oh.